Hey YouTube and welcome back to Blockchain Bets. When asking that very important question, when is the best time to enter? We often get answers like Sometimes may be good, sometimes may be shit. Today we're going to look at the actual numbers to see when is the best time to get into the game. We'll look at the return on investment, daily profit, and the monthly earnings for three dates. October 22nd, 2021, when the token prices were at their peak value. January 22nd, 2022, three months later, and February 1st, 2022, today's date, after quite a large fall in prices due to the overall bear market. First, we'll start by looking at the prices today. So these are the token prices for today for each token, and the price per wax is around 32 cents USD. The cost for each NFT ranges from $47 up to just under $2,000 with the hourly earnings ranging from around $0.09 cents to $4. Um, and your return on investments around 20 to 30 days and your earnings per month range from $65 to just under $3,000 per month. For the next one we're going to look at I chose October 22nd, where if you can see here, it is pretty much the highest peak for most of the coins. Um, for food here, we're almost at a uh, 3.58 wax. So if we look here, we're at, oh, I used 3.51 for uh, food. Lumber was at 7.2796 wax, and gold was at 7. 589 wax with the price of each wax token valued at 30.87 cents USD. Now you can see the prices for each NFT were absolutely insane. A fishing boat at $40,000, chainsaw at $45,000, and the cheapest one you could buy was the stone axe at $915. But what these could earn you was absolutely insane as well. Your return on investment was a bit quicker at around like just under 10 days all the way up to 20 days, uh, making from as low as $91 all the way up to almost 50, uh, higher than $5,500. That means monthly you can get as low as $2,700 all the way up to $170,000. So comparing that to three months later, which would be January 22nd, 2022, you can see that token prices took a huge dive. And we can see that here on the chart. It pretty much fell to their original token prices at launch. That in turn caused the NFT prices to come down too, uh, ranging from as low as $49 up to almost $2,500 and the return on investment varying from 15 days to um, around just over 30 and the monthly earnings from $67 all the way up to just under 4000 So what does all this mean? Is it better to buy when prices are low due to the bear market? In my opinion, yes. Prices for the NFTs are cheaper, which makes the earnings lower as well. But when the market increases, the token prices may follow. Therefore, your earnings will too. Meaning you received an NFT at discounted prices. And you can take those tokens earned and sell when the market recovers. These lower NFT prices make the barrier to entry much lower, making it more affordable for new users to join and growing the game's economy. Also, if you invested in the NFT on the peak prices, Unless you had enough time to earn those back before the crash, and it would have been very tight to do so as the crash happened not long after, you would have a significant loss on that purchase. Some NFTs were up to $90,000 at their peak, and are, those same NFTs are around $2,000 now. If you were one of those who entered in those early days of the game, comment below. I'd be very interested to hear if you made a lot or took a loss so far. Are you still holding on for dear life? I hope you found this video useful. Please like and subscribe for more content like this. 
where we go through and break things down with numbers and facts so you can make informed decisions. Of course, this is me just sharing what I look at. And as a disclaimer, you should always be doing your own research. And this is not financial advice. Thanks for tuning in and see you next time.